for each of these different things, but we really felt really strongly that it was important that we get recognized. I think the thing that we need to do more of is, I mean, this is sort of a next step for me, is to reach out to all the um, staff people at the community college and the state college level that are involved with degrees like human service degrees or criminal justice degrees, whether it be an associate's or bachelor's, and really let them know that their students could benefit from this. Mm -hmm. An example is we had three students from Norwich University, which is the, I guess you would call it a military academy, I'm not quite sure. Um, three students come through. Two of those students had started an anti-sexual violence program on campus. Okay, so there's this intersection then of education and what we're seeing, um, um, National Guard and in the armed services around sexual violence. Those two directly connected up because we had folks from the state level of National Guard talking to these young students who were at Nor Norwich University who were also working with the anti-violence programs in that community um, to start up this program. So that's the kind of example we want to see is the folks connecting up to one another. I, I guess I should stop there. Yeah, because we want to, <laughs> yep. I'm sure you have triggered. Uh, we have all like kind of given a lot of food for thought and there's probably a lot of questions, either of us or certainly of each other. So we did want to move into the, um, we're going to just in terms of being mindful of time, move into the table discussions because I think a lot of what people may have on their